That said, our players showed a lot in the second half there, and uh, we need to take our confidence from that. Good luck, Graham. Thank you very much. And uh, here, just for Alan, is a reminder of that <laughs> 2011 <laughs> Stevenage win over Newcastle. He knew it was coming. Uh, the score of the second goal uh, was Michael Boswick, now a regular for Peterborough. Uh, the omens are there, Alan, aren't they? Uh, there he is, a big player for Peterborough, big beard. Big beard, <laughs> absolutely, yeah. Can play in midfield, but uh, we will be playing centre half uh, this evening, like he did in the uh, in the first game. And he's a, he's a guy that can play, that can bring the ball out, like lack, like likes to to start the attacks off. I would say here, running the ball forward, creating an attack, not frightened to stay at the uh, to get the back and, and get the ball in the box and. What West Brom did on Saturday, particularly with John Joe Shelby, is give him time to do this. Now, if West Brom do that tonight, then they'll, they'll cause all sorts of problems for themselves. And Boswick can do that. That was a warning to them. They didn't learn their lesson. Again, wanting to bring the ball out. Superb ball in. This is the, uh, the first goal for Coulthurst. Very good ball, superb finish. Last few minutes of the game, he's now pushed into midfield. Again, picks time to pick his head up and play a pass. And a great finish in the last few minutes from, uh, from Taylor. So if they give him that amount of time and space tonight to pick his head up and to pick passes, he'll have runners that are prepared to go in behind and they'll cause them all sorts of problems. Well, Took a replay at Bristol City to go through in the last round. It's a scrubby old affair down at that pass and away. Boswick up from the back at six foot three. Twice an FA Trophy winner scored for Stevenage against Alan Shearer's Newcastle, as we were hearing. Again, it's Taylor who was hungriest there. This game. Goalkeeper stopped his effort. Should have beaten him, though. One to one. Samuelson. Michael Boswick. Spur with Stevenage, including promotion into the league. Ducked into that is Jakob. Fletcher wants an FA Cup winner with Manchester United. They say he might be in the Irish squad in the summer. In comes the corner kick. Flicked on! Oh! By the big man from the back, Boswick! This was oh, yeah, blown anywhere. Anyway. Right there, didn't he? He's got no right, Boswick, to get to that. Do you see the, the size of some of those? Well, West Bromwich yeah, Owen won't be happy there, Tony Pullis. Not sure how he gets to that in front of everybody. People ball watching a little bit. Just gets you in front of the front man. Where's the foul in there? I don't know where the foul is, I'm not sure what the referee's seen. On Olsen, maybe. Flapped at that, didn't he? Has played a lot of his mid, uh, career in midfield, Michael Boswick, earlier this season. And for Peterborough, moved back uh, into central defence in about November. His uh, Berahino got away. Baldwin is to the right hand side, and here's Boswick. Passing. I really like the way that they're passing the ball. Good structure to the team. Two lads up front, we've got plenty of pace. Zakwani. Boswick. Baldwin was faster to the loose ball than Gardner. Yeah, and he's trying to play though, in fairness to him. It didn't come off, but he got back quickly. Fox. To Bostwick. Again to Baldwin. Fox who curls it in, Boswick was there. Much better, much better ball in, wasn't it, from Fox on this occasion. Look at this, it good height on it, good weight. Boswick nearly getting on the end of it. Just misses it. Jacob was in the middle there. Was the meat and the sandwich and made contact with it. Best in the FA Cup quarter finalists in 64 65. Chelsea beat them. It's the run where they beat Arsenal. We've seen nothing of Berahino, really. Simon's a Peterborough player on loan uh, in February 2009. Played five games on loan for Manchester United. It's Boswick. Samuelson. A substitute, you've got to be thinking you're coming on at any moment and be ready. You can see clearly, didn't something. make it when they first came into league football. He was at Wigan, didn't make an appearance. First 
FA Cup tie in five years. The second, I should say, playing at Villa. He's also suffering from a bit of a back problem that made him... Marahino with a touch out wide from McLean. And Boswick was there with the clearance. Yeah. To call the on loan at Wigan earlier this season, but he picked up an injury there. And we're in that now. Career ended at 28. Not by Boswick, his captain. Very difficult to see which is the Premier League team here and which is the Division One. Whatever happens tonight, there's a real positivity about Peter Brown. The West Brom under 21s. He's at White Hart Lane. It's a free kick for West Brom. Away by the man Mountain Boswick. I'd like to see him in a, in a tag wrestling match with Vasilevsky of Leicester. <laughs> But he certainly does very well. I don't think I've ever seen him have a bad game, Boswick. Good man, isn't he? Good footballer, though. And a lovely pass of the ball. We saw that in the first game with the delivery for the yeah. second goal. Plays in midfield and central defence. Well, they'll be selling off for a profit, no doubt, as they have done so many. Dwight Gale and... Uh, Scored to make it 2-2 two -two at the Hawthorns, and he puts Peterborough ahead. to slice that one by Boswick and Sesson you're ready to come on by Boswick and will the pain has won it and shielded away had to stretch for the loose ball and Boswick was there never saw him play but everyone tells me he was one of the greatest Georgie Best of course he Certainly was. 2000 ones packed into this ground to watch an FA Cup tie against uh, Swansea in 65. Brown in the setup behind the scenes. It's a free, almost a free header just up over the bar, I think by Gardner in the end. Angle was into the first header. It was won too easily. Well, it's Boswick, isn't it? At that far post, Olsen there just letting him have a free header. And then Gardner puts it over the, over the bar. Very fortunate there. For Berahino. Do have a, a buffer at the moment between them. Boswick. Taylor. 12 minutes away from extra time. Here's Boswick. Another searching pass. Can play them. Comes back. Berahino couldn't hold it up, needs to hold it up there. Rondon with the run. That's a push. Berahino pushed his man. Rondon didn't think sell either, did he really? Rondon there, he's, he shows far too much of that ball there. Boswick again, just takes it off him. He's been excellent, hasn't he, Michael Boswick? Well, he's, you know what you're getting from him, he's just solid, he doesn't overplay, always makes good decisions. You need those reliable team players. Another player who had a letdown at the start of his career was at Millwall, Martin. Didn't make the grade, didn't play for them, went out on loan to the likes of Crawley and so on. Comes Melton in uh, South London. A jack ball, but he gets the dead ball line. And away by that man, Michael Boswick again. Costa Rican international. West Brom look for Rondon. The goalkeeper's come a long way. Will it come for Berahino? Boswick with the vital clearance. He's been astounding. Well, he read that beautifully, didn't he? Got to be careful, Peter Brahe, getting on done on the break. They've been drawn on by their opponent. Knows what it is to be a winner under Graham Wesley, Michael Boswick from the Stevenage days, the trophy win, the promotion into the league with Stevenage, but here's McLean. 
And there he is again, Boswick. McLean will just keep... Gardner with it. Taken away by Boswick. So close for West Bromwich Albion taking the lead. Well, the goalkeeper does exceptionally well in the end, and look at that man again. Boswick just reading it. As the keeper comes out, he just tucks into the goal. Just reads it beautifully. But they are Premier League players. So, whoever they brought in... Well, of course. But, you know, it's an opportunity for the lower league player to prove that there's nothing in it between them. On, on the away by Fletcher. Big Bostwick. How do you see it going this time? I've got to say, Michael Bostwick's been brilliant. I think I'm proud of all my team. They've done absolutely fantastic. And the corner to Rondon. McLean very nearly through. He claims the foul as Bostwick went to ground. Sets up Fletcher for a shot. Could this be the moment that decides it? It's a high looper and a catch to come. Headed away by Boswick and then we'll no, a single been excellent. Outside. Good cross in. Rondon's finish was and touch was hesitant, not convincing. He's come out. Out by Pocanoli. Big Bostwick, and again. Here's McClay. Inside, could shoot from here. Great block, Boswick. We're going to have to rename Boswick, Mr Block. The amount of times you've said that tonight. Excellent, I mean, this has just comes inside McLean. And off, off comes Boswick, look, reads it, gets down low, and gets that barrier in the way. First class. That is blocked by Boswick. Boswick cracks it away. Seems to have been around forever, Michael Boswick. 27. In all those games at non league level. Big man, huge presence tonight. Ooh, very nearly came to Berahino. Players are looking tired now. McLean. Last attack of the first half of uh, extra time. Boswick was sold there. Rondon Boswick goes to ground. Good tackle. And on the ground, in the air, passing the ball, covering. Heroic, Excellent. isn't it? Unbelievable. He's actually out of position there. He doesn't give up, he gets back into position. Makes the tackle. And Fletcher's giving it away. Madison's cross flashes through. Half time, extra time, still 1 1. He's on his haunches, no wonder, Martin. He's given his all. Yeah, I mean, he's the senior man and he's the youngest one. Such a balance, both equally as important for this team. They look tired, they look like they put everything into that first 90 minutes in the last oh. five minutes or so, that extra time period, they were, they were dead on the feet. So it's going to be difficult for them, but they've still got a bit of life and they've still got a bit of quality, haven't that they? That guy we just saw on the floor there as well, Boswick, he's been just yeah. superb as well. Some of the tackles that, that he's put in has been it's brilliant. A bit of, life a bit of, a bit of grit. <laughs> <laughs> well, the crowd are all loving it and uh, we're thoroughly enjoying it. Um, this could go either way. Um, last 15 minutes coming up. Uh, don't forget the um, news if you're waiting for that. We'll uh, follow after extra time or indeed, of course, a penalty shootout. There goes Boswick getting the troops ready uh, for the um, second half of extra time. Jonathan. Thanks very much, chaps. If, if this was in, you're watching this in black and white, imagine his picture in black and white. Then think of all the pictures of the FA Cup teams in the 1880s, the era of Kinnaird. He, he sort of fits in with that, that sort of rumbustious centre-half who was everywhere. He's been brilliant. I'm sure I've seen his beard turning grey, he's been out there that long. He'll keep going though for his team. Touch off there by Austin up. He's a, a player of skill. More talent. Drifted out to a lower league Turkish clubs after that. Zakwani. 
Bostwick. You'd have made it in those the Wanderers teams, the great teams of the 1880s, 1890s. You see there, Bostwick, the way he took it. was a difficult ball, but it showed there that he can play. Okay, the pass to come, but he doesn't panic. Bostwick. Bostwick been to Wembley as a, a winner and a loser in the trophy. It's a cross called for. Bostwick again, it's been everywhere. with the cross, away by Boswick, oh, off the line, that's Aguani, down the deny. Michael Boswick coming forward for Peterborough. He scored three penalties this season in normal play for Peterborough. I think he's the only player out there, actually, in both sides have actually scored a penalty this season. West Bromwich Albion get an early advantage. Well, he's done nothing wrong all night. He's been a hero. Determined, focused. Bandit! Steely determination. Said everything about him there. Focused, professional. Wasn't in doubt.